to introduce a Spanish dish called gazpacho. G A Z P A C H O is one of my favorite Spanish dish as it is super easy to make, delicious and healthy. It may be served with an appetizer or a drink. Gazpacho is a cold soup made up of raw and blended vegetables. So now let's move to the ingredients needed. First of all, you will need you will need six to seven medium tomatoes. The quality of the tomatoes is one of the most important factors in the taste. Use wine ripened tomatoes when possible, and don't use the green salad tomatoes. Next, uh, one green Italian pe pepper is the long type, not about pepper. One cucumber, half of a small white onion, one clove of garlic, not too big, one over four cup extra virgin olive oil. Again, quality is important. A splash of sherry vinegar, a pinch or two of salt, and for your toppings is optional. Uh, you may choose diced cucumber, diced green apple, diced onion, diced pepper, or even croutons okay now for the recipe it have 10 step here but don't worry it's all very super easy very super duper easy to prepare yeah so first you need to wash and dry all of the vegetables very well if you prefer you can peel the tomatoes uh, although I usually leave the skin on uh, next, you can cut the tomatoes into 4 slices. You need to leave the core behind and put into your blender. Okay, next step. Half core and this it. The pepper, cut it into a few slices and add to the blender. Next, peel the garlic and slice it in half. Remove the core which often result in bitterness when not cooked. And the fifth, you need to cut the onion into a few slices and add it to the blender too. Number six, you need to peel the cucumber and cut it in half. Add half to the blender and save the other half for your topping. Number seven, you need to blend the vegetables at a high speed until it's completely pure. Number eight, uh, you need to add the salt and vinegar and while blending on a slow speed, slowly add the olive oil. Okay, now you can taste and adjust the salt and vinegar. If the, if the texture is too thick for your liking, add another, add some cold water. Then, and then the last step, you need to refrigerate and serve it very cold. You can add as many or as few toppings as you like okay so here i pronounce i provide with other ideas for gazpacho toppings for example marinated cherry tomatoes uh, avocado tart cherries strawberries or even raw red bell pepper and here's and um, that's all for today's spanish dish recipe introductions and hope you like it and happy cooking adios